Hello everybody, it is Cook from the channel Game Fanatic Cook, and today as you can probably guess from our title, I want to talk about the speedrunning in the Monster Hunter community, or more the lack thereof, a speedrunning <coughs> community when it comes to the Monster Hunter. And the reason I want to talk about this is because speedrunning is kind of taking the world by storm, or it has been over the past couple years. I think it's something very interesting to watch, it's very fun to watch speedrunning, very impressive, very cool stuff. And I've been trying to find like different records or world records for like how fast a Baggy is killed in Monster Hunter Rise or how fast a Wraithlos is killed. And I'm just really interested in knowing those stats and seeing those runs of that happening. But besides individual like speed hunts you can find on YouTube, there really isn't a set record. So while you still can find those very fast hunts because, you know, players naturally kind of want to speed run and get through a monster hunt as soon as possible. There's not really a... Library of Alexandria for Monster Hunter speedruns. And naturally, I was looking for it online. The only website I really found with any kind of speedrun records for Monster Hunter is speedrunning.com, which I believe is the current largest database for speedrunning in general. And I'm going to show you just the Monster Hunter pages here, real quick, in this video, just to show how there's maybe there's like 50 runners total for Monster Hunter Rise, like 30 for World. And it's only for um, completing the game speed runs, not for indiv individual monsters or quests or anything like that. When rea in reality, there should be a different category for every monster or quest or whatever. You know, there just isn't a big enough speedrunning community around Monster Hunter to really warrant that. Which is why I'm making this video. Not because I believe I can, I really have the skills to, you know, make <laughs> waves in a speedrunning community in Monster Hunter. Even though certainly I'm going to be posting some times here. Like I killed a baggie in like 50 seconds. I was pretty proud of that. Which has even got me thinking about this. Obviously people can do it faster. But it just made me think like. Why isn't there just a speedrunning community. That's like together and connected for Monster Hunter. When it's, it's just an awesome game to speedrun. With the action, the combat, and the different strategies that people would use, the different items. And it's just something I really wish would take off. It'd be really entertaining to see. Which is, again, why I'm making this video. Uh, so yeah. It really it's really shows there's no official speedrunning action going on right now. You can't even look up world records. Most of those videos with those records on speedrunning.com. I mean, most of those records, they don't have video with them. So you don't know if they're real, to be honest with you. So yeah. It kind of sucks. There needs to be a way to share our fastest times in like a global database for different monsters, and I think that'd be awesome. Because you can go on YouTube right now and look at like fastest world record Wraithlos hunt, and some random person is going to have the fastest Wraithlos hunt ever, and someone else is going to have the fastest someone's ever killed a Wraithlos, and it's just going to be everyone claiming it without like an official database with proof ranking it. I just think that'd be so awesome to have like speed hunts. On a global database, able to see the speedrunning of hunting different monsters. Um, yeah, I think that's pretty much my entire video, um, and I really do hope that happens. Obviously, I'm a smaller YouTuber here, so I don't know how much pool I have in the Monster Hunter community. But sometimes we get some alright views, and a lot of you guys, I really appreciate you always watching. Might uh, be into that idea. Just let me know what you guys think of, you know, speedrunning <laughs> different monsters. So I feel like it would be cool if we could try to start making waves or something like that. And uh, just see how it goes. But once again, I'm kind of a small guy, so who knows. And uh, beyond that, but yeah, like I said, I'm probably going to be doing some speedrunning videos. Maybe just streams, I'm not really sure. I might start streaming on YouTube, by the way, if anyone's interested in that. Also, the video's over at this point right now. Like, right, I already talked about what I wanted to talk about. Now it's just me rambling about my YouTube channel. Um, but yeah, so I might be planning on doing some speedrunning content myself i'll probably make a poll for it if we want me to stream it on youtube or if you guys would rather me just upload videos of it i'll probably stream it i'm thinking or maybe both even you know because i don't know why not and uh besides that we're trying to hit 200 subscribers by the end of the month which is a pretty insane goal for me um i don't <laughs> i don't really know if it's possible but i don't want to say 200 subscribers by the end of the year because i feel like we'll definitely hit that but I don't want to say in like two months because that's like just such a, a goofy specific amount of time. So we're saying month and I really hope you guys help me get there. I'd really appreciate it. Sorry I had to show myself in here at the end of the video. And basically half the video has been me just talking about nothing relevant to the video. Uh, but thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate all of you. Stay blessed and this has been Game Fanatic Cook.